my last little video I showed you how I put the gold leaf on. Now um, I let it dry for a whole day and I'm just going to scratch away the surplus gold leaf like this. See what we have underneath. This is always quite exciting. Let's see if it's worked properly. I love doing this bit. Just take away the surplus. In my last video I made a mistake, I said actually Paul Nichols um, owned Cato Star and he lived in Ditchit. Unfortunately I found out that really that Cato Star died 2015. Um, he wasn't owned by Paul Nichols, I think Paul Nichols was the trainer. And then he went on afterwards to do dressage, which I thought was a bit mean, really, after all his racing years. I think he should have been put to retirement, but that's just me. We all have different ideas of things, and I guess if you own these animals, you, you want them to go on and do different things. Oh, the music in the background, by the way, is Pink Floyd Echoes Pom in Pompeii. So there we are. It's coming together. I might have to put quite a lot more gold leaf on. Now I know what, um, what I've got left here. And I can use up all these little bits that I'm rubbing off. You can see with the gold size how well it sticks. In fact, there's bits of it here and there where I didn't realise it was going to go. And um, to remove that, actually, because it sticks so well with the gold size, I might actually have to just fine sandpaper it just there or maybe just paint over it I'm not sure yet so that's the next stage so what I'm going to do now is look at this painting and see where I can go next with it quite lovely actually the gold leafing. I might get a, a harder brush as well just to give it a bit more of a stiffer rub off there to get that off the canvas because it's as you can see it's not all coming away or maybe I'll just leave it I'm not sure yet so you can see how gold leaf just lifts the painting. Thank you for watching.